it's just me and I'm not very fucking good on this stuff. And I know Tim, Tim is, believes that it's all witchcraft. And so, yeah. Hey. That's right, Tim. Technology is good for only one thing and one thing only making weapons. <laughs> Separately, you guys both fall through fire, screaming, and what sounds like metal tearing, and wake up in a very comfortable bed on the... Ah, oh, there's fire. No, oh, there's a bed. <laughs> um, right. Let's see. Tim, you are in room I, and Mike, you are in room J. You guys are separate, but you both have a strong feeling that your buddy is in the next room. <laughs> you can't remember your buddy's name right now. It's one of those, oh, no, it's I've got a brain fart, oh, type of things. Uh, I look around. What kind of room is it? It looks it's like, like room? Uh, uh, do you have any history type stuff? It's not a hospital room. It, it looks like uh, the kind of place that, did. like, do you, give me a history roll. Oh, for rolling dice, um, if you, on the uh, roll 20 on the left-hand column thing, there's a <laughs> picture of uh, dice. <clears throat> if, you click, if you click that and go to advanced roll, because they haven't got it in the basic roll, because people are fucking playing D20, D20 for some shit, uh, then you can roll a D100. And it shows up in your color. Like uh, Tim's is kind of a greenish currently. Mike's is a bluish. You can change your color somehow. I'm not sure how. You can configure that out for some reason. Mm -hmm. Oh, there it is. You click the color and you're good. Yeah, and it also says in the, uh, the chat thing, it also uh, lists off. Mm -hmm. Cool. So both of you failed your roles. Excellent. It looks where the, like... Where is the result? I don't see it on my screen anywhere. It's on the right-hand side. There's like a chat column. You have to make sure yeah. you hit the... Yeah. Uh, you can also see the dice if you do it somehow. Then like my dice, I'm still seeing on the table. But yeah, if you click uh, chat on the right-hand column, TJ, then Got it, it. it... Yeah. So All right. there you go. It looks like the kind of like uh, place you would rent, but uh, unlike unlike what you guys both probably expect, there's no t television in the room. It smells uh, clean, but like uh, vaguely of mothballs and a little bit of dust. But uh, it looks it looks like the kind of place that's clean, but definitely not fancy. I start checking my body over for burns. No, none, which is odd. You seem to be in as good of health as uh, you recall being in, wherever that was. You feel okay. really fuzzy, like you haven't had coffee in a long time. Uh, what kind of clothes am I wearing? My clothes or something else? Uh, you're not wearing any clothes currently. Um, you do you do see some that are draped over a chair, and they look like um, uh, the kind of suit your grandfather might have worn. Uh, there's weird shit like uh, uh, suspenders for your, or like uh, straps for your socks to keep your socks up and shit. Okay. All right. All uh, right. Yeah. Same uh, for your Michael I, as well. I will uh, uh, brazenly try and uh, stand up from my bed and uh, wow. walk towards Naked. the the door. Naked. Uh, well, I guess I stand up naked, and then uh, realizing I have no clothes on, um, look around for clothes. I've uh, draped over the chair, pretty much the same situation as uh, uh, Tim's going through, but in a slightly different room. Okay, well, I will see if it fits. It does. It does. It, it, it's, if they look serviceable, nothing fancy, but uh, kind of a, a suit type thing, you know? All right. Was there Fair a enough. camera in uh, my room? I start looking around for a camera. I understand. I, no, if there is, it's a well-hidden pinhole camera, is your guess. Uh, right. Uh, without getting off the bed, I look under the bed. 
that way the monster underneath can't get you. Yes. <laughs> uh, no problem. Uh, under the bed it is a. Um, it, it looks like kind of a bowl, but uh, it doesn't go straight up on the sides. It kind of goes out, like it, it's it's kind of a weird bowl. Um, it's oddly <laughs> shaped too. Christ. Did I get abducted um, in the middle of fighting a fire? What the fuck? I, I check all the pockets of my suit, see if there's anything inside there. There is nothing inside of there. You literally have just the clothes you are now standing up in. Great. Uh, I'm going to try and leave my room. No problem. It looks as like it, the door is bolted, but on your side. So you just have to reach oh, over great. your hand and unbolt it if you wanted to. But it's bolted from your side. That's uh, exciting. Uh, there's no people or anything like that? There's just the door? No. No people. Just right. the, just a normal door. It looks fairly sturdy, like it'd be a kind of pain in the ass kicking it. By the way, when you're redistributing points, something that was missed on the character sheet, but I think I mentioned to you guys, app slash luck is now a skill, starting at 25, mm -hmm. just as strength is, and dex slash maneuver is. Also... Dodge is under dex slash maneuver. I'm guessing everybody's going to have 60 in this, but I could be wrong. Yep. <laughs> Seems like a good way to spend your points. <laughs> it doesn't seem bad to me. Um, I'm, I'm going to unbolt my door. No and, problem. Uh, it opens up into a hallway. As you can see on the map, there's a couple of uh, 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 red carpets uh, that run down the hallway. And there's other other room doors and then the stairs down. Okay. Uh, well, sensing my friend, I'm, I'm going to knock uh, three times on the eye door. Holy shit, TJ, they found you. What do you do? <sighs> uh, you hear that from inside the room, Michael. Uh, oh, God, they've gotten the, – the fire's changed them. <laughs> <laughs> Who is it? Who is there? I, uh, uh, Woolmer? I remember a Woolmer. Woolmer. Wait, Where? you are Woolmer? Yes? Question mark? Hmm. Right. <laughs> I will now, uh, as quiet as possible, migrate my way toward the clothes and check them. Make sure there's nothing, uh... I want, on them. I want a sneak roll because of possible hilarity. All right. Uh, I got to move this window. The fuck it. No, no. Shrink no, all you got to do is just, uh, you don't have to move any windows, T. Oh, oh I'm sorry. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so when I click on that, I lose my entire window for, there we go. Well, no, I mean, there's literally a dice thing. That's I know. Fair. Every time I hit the die to roll, oh. it closes the window that has the results. Really? You can, uh, you can type slash roll space 1D100, and it will it will roll as well in, in the chat bar. Cool. All right, so let's close that. Open this. I want to try that now. Go, Michael. Go, Michael. Nice. Nice. See a 96. Mm -hmm. so slash... Roll B100. Oh, one yeah. Now that didn't work. Um, roll. It's forward slash roll Got space it. one B100. Oh, okay. Got it. So you failed your stealth, oh, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I make noise. Migrate over to the close. No problem. You hear somebody thrashing around in there, sir. Uh, uh, he's in trouble. I start battering the door down. Uh, no problem. Give me a strength roll, please. <laughs> wow. Nine. Okay, yeah, take a check oh. in strength. Door fucking flies open. The lock breaks off, uh, bouncing across the room. You see a naked guy hovering over clothes in a chair with his back to you and his ass exposed. What do you do? I scream. Ah! Oh, it's just you. <laughs> Were the clothes on a chair? 
Yeah, draped over the chair. No, <laughs> give me a throw roll. <laughs> can can I catch it? Sure, give me a catch roll. That'll be impressive. Uh, I catch it. Wow. And he does catch it. <laughs> impressive. The clothes are like kind of in a line between you and him because they fluttered off the chairs. The chair curled through the intervening space. But yes, um, you've given him the chair. He now Morning. has a chair. Morning, Wilmer. <laughs> um, uh, um, you look really familiar. Um, what, how did you get here? How did I get here? Mm. You remember what we were doing? I know what I was doing. Don't know what you were doing. Okay. That's fantastic. You should probably put these pants on. Wow. Well, yeah. Let me get to that. I, uh, put on clothes and stuff. I'm, I'm, Wilmer feels better. Definitely uh, do. Reduce your hands to oil, oh, yeah. Where the fuck did they go up? Uh, as he's changing his clothes, I'm going to look up and down the hallway to uh, kind of like a uh, door half open, peering up and down the hallway to see if there's any movement. No, no. Uh, give me a listen roll at either half or negative 30, your choice. It's the same. How do I get rid of a card? Super. That's a good question. Uh, try dragging it over to uh, somewhere near the discard pile or, or the deck itself because then you can make your own discard pile. Oh, man. Is there a uh, max hand size? Six for you right now if there was one more player before. All right. Uh, looks like I was given a soul survivor. Everyone but you discards all their cards immediately. No trading. There you go. I made a... Uh, uh, Warden spot up here near the deck so TJ can dump all his cards there. All right. So, nice. the, all right. and then I guess I put that in the yellow pile there, that, that space there. Yep. Okay. Yes, now TJ gets to harbor vague resentments against you for the rest of the game because, you know, it's wonderful. Uh, yeah, it's Instead definitely my, my fault. How the mm -hmm. fuck do I <laughs> Don't want to look at the card anymore. I just want to click it and drag it. Thank you. No, nope, quit looking. Don't care. The, eventually, you guys will figure out how this works because I have no idea right every, now. Every time I go to click and drag it, it's like, hey, you want to look at this? No, no, I don't. I want to throw it. Uh, cool. Yeah, sure. All right. So, yeah, you, you don't see anything going on, Michael. Nothing seems to be happening. Looking out the hallway... The only thing of interest is uh, kind of an incongruous uh, thing. It, I've, un I've uh, taken away the fog of war from it, so you'll see it to the right of the map that you're currently seeing. Uh, yeah. It looks like uh, some sort of really old grandfather clock about as tall as you. Do you have any uh -huh. history or arch or anything like that? Yeah, I have, hi I have history. Sure, give me a roll. Um, there you go. It's at half. Wow. It looks like a 16th century French uh, grandfather clock. Not the kind of thing you expect to see here. A bit odd. Maybe somebody it, went to France. It is working. look immaculately taken care of, like it's in good condition? This person cares a lot about their clock. Every Everything here looks like uh, they care about their stuff, but it's like, um, you're going to guess, this, this is like... Um, a working man's kind of house type thing, but the clock looks a bit fancier for that. It, it, it'd be like uh, going into where, where you live and finding a Steinway piano, for example. Odd. Fair enough. Uh, how sturdy looking was that chair? Uh, it, it's made of probably oakish type stuff, so you could probably batter apart the clock if you really wanted to take away their... No, home I want to take one of the legs off of the chair. Uh, sure, give me a strength roll to shred the chair. Rawr. He's trying to use his arms and legs and strength and rawr, mighty TJ. 
whoever he is. Nobody has an idea. He's the man with no name currently, apparently. Yeah, I'll get that done here in a second. Uh-huh. Wow. Okay. Uh, you sharpen it. You're ready for Vampire City. Excellent. It's your leg now, or a small club, whichever you want. Uh, let, yeah, let's go for a club. Sure. Mm. Um, right. Okay. So let's do the introduction thing. Uh, Wilmer, correct? What did you do for a living, Wilmer, before you got here? I don't right recall. I, uh, I, I remember how to move and how to put Are my you... pants on, but, uh, I don't remember what, uh, what I was doing before or. Well, actually you can uh... come up with whatever story you want. But it's whatever your character believes. If he doesn't want to, if you don't want him to remember anything, that's fine too. But if you're like, for I now, was a porn star is, or whatever. Yeah. For now, everything is hazy. Um, I'm sure things will come back to me as a as we move around. Uh, by the way, it's it's Scott. It's Scott Wilmer. Scott, got it. Scott Wilmer. Put it in the chat just so you'll have that. Question, man. Got it. Right. Uh, Colburn. Colborn. Sorry. Mm. Um, I'm. I look thirty. Black hair. Uh, brown eyes. Um, my hands are kind of weathered. They have a lot of calluses on them. Right. Uh, how the hell does my guy look? Ah. Uh, Maddox. Like, uh, maybe late 20s, uh, beard, uh, scars uh, here and there, uh, burn scar on his right arm. Uh, yeah, looks uh, like he'd be home as a lumberjack. Uh, but if do our characters know each other at all? Uh, you both feel that you definitely know or should know each other, but it's just a bit hazy. Okay. So I'll tell right you now. as much about me as uh, most people generally knew. Maybe that'll help fire in your memories at all of maybe how you know me. Because I feel like I know you, but I don't remember anything else. Uh, okay. I, uh, I was a fire investigator, and I volunteered fighting wildfires in California. Okay. How I know you? Don't know. Uh, hung out at a couple bars. Uh, maybe that's how I met you. I, I, I too partook a partook at a few bars. However, uh, I, I was not the uh, the giving sort, if I remember right. I was more of the taking sort. I pulled my club a little tighter. <laughs> <laughs> Great. Uh, give me smell rolls, please. Sure. Hmm, I smell well. What do I smell? Mm. My, my five, my critical. Nice. PJ? Uno momento, por favor. Why? Mm, fucking technology. You just got to type forward slash roll 1D100. Uh, actually, trying to smart, open, you can I'm trying to open that copy fucking and paste it. chat window because it has decided to shrink itself down into the size of like an ant. Uh, motherfucker. I'm, I'm not sure why the whole dice thing doesn't work for you because I can actually do the roll. Oh, the, and that the roll works, works really for well. I need to be able to actually see inside the bar. Ah, there we go. Thank God. I rolled a fucking crit. I rock. Shit. Because if you do the roll with the dice, then it also makes dice appear. For reasons. Okay, Tim, you don't smell shit. But you might. You smell bacon. Hmm. No place I've ever been that's been bad has had bacon before, so. Bacon? Uh, my, uh, my stomach's real grumbly as well. 
Sure. Um, it, does the smell of bacon waft down the hallway? I uh, quite possibly. You're, you're, uh, well, you did get a crit. Yes, you think it's from downstairs. Mm. I, I mean, you could just, with a crit, I'll let you bloodhound it all the way back to the bacon <laughs> if you want. Uh, uh, I'll follow. You want to just get on all Cole, fours? And Cole just start going? Huh? Matt, Maddox, I, I can't resist the alluring smell of bacon, so uh, I uh, I follow follow the uh, smell of bacon. No problem. He bloodhounds it down the stairs. I've revealed a new map, and also the uh, uh, the people that are working here. Um, they have a breakfast buffet set up. And uh, it doesn't, it looks like enough food to feed two really hungry people, but not a lot extra. Um, and they, they are, uh, it's in the uh, dining room, letter G. Mm -hmm. And uh, the they, lady's like, oh, good morning and happy Friday to you. I uh, I suspect you're you're hungry. Please, uh, 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 breakfast and dinner are included with your with your rent. I need a lot more explanation. I looking around uh, down here. Do either <laughs> oh, both of you can give me history uh, rolls. I'm want. saying that to her. Oh, she goes to her with ah. a club resting on my shoulder. She she looks a bit nervous and the guy and steps closer to her or what could be her husband they are both wearing wedding rings um well you you came in late last night you both wanted a room uh and then this morning you came down and breakfast she motions it, it's a simple but hearty breakfast we're talking Eggs, bacon, pancakes, and shit like that, you know. You'll have to forgive me. I had a really rough night. So oh, it's all right. coming in is a little vague. Um, no problem. Do you have a right newspaper? Town? A newspaper? No, I'm sorry, we don't. Uh, you're in Burlington, sir. Burlington. You, you, I'm sure you're in the right town. They smile Burlington. and nod at you. Yes, sir. Uh, North uh, Carolina? Pardon? No, it's in the United States, sir. Burling. It's in the. Okay. That's right. They both smile and nod. <laughs> Excellent. They look relieved. Uh, they. She says you can pick out whichever plates you want and uh, serve yourself. Uh, Is there I anything? Uh, would you like some coffee? Uh, uh, actually, yes. if I came in late last night, uh, where are my clothes? Uh, you were wearing those. Did you, you didn't have it. Uh, no, you were wearing those. You didn't have any luggage, which, but I, I don't know. That's how you came in, sir. She I smiles see. and looks reassured. Uh, both of you guys can give me empathy rolls. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm hmm. Mm hmm. You have to tell me pass, fail, and stuff. I'm not watching the dice. Oh, fail. For something fail. Else. Uh, th this is fine. This is great. I go over and put oh, some eggs right. on my plate, I sausage, base of 10. <laughs> get myself a biscuit, some gravy, sit down, wait for my uh, coffee to be brought. No problem. They bring it on over. It looks like good, wholesome food to you. Yeah, everything looks great. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Enjoy, she says. I assume it tastes great too. Just it really home. does. It, 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 mm -hmm. It's very wholesome. Uh, you're watching them eat as you're sitting there with your club. Um, she uh, I, brings I you a coffee. On my lap. Okay. Then, Did you uh, want to get food too, but not uh, eat it? If, uh, ah, is it paper napkins or cloth napkins? Cloth. Cloth. I look around. Are there paper anywhere? Uh, no. Hmm. Uh, cloth, right. tablecloths as well. It's it's not a fancy right. place. But it's not fancy cloth, but it's it's nice. It is. Okay. Yeah, I wrap up a, a good amount of the bacon in a uh, napkin and stuff she, it into a pocket. She looks as though you just pulled out a fucking duck, made it shit on the table, and then put it back. I 
don't eat until later in the morning for religious purposes. Oh, oh come on, I, friend. You can eat. Just just eat here. What are you going to do? Take that with you? Uh, yes. Well, there, there, there is the A&W in town also if you want food later, sir. Yeah. I'm, uh, oddly enough, here to be running a little short on funds, seeing as that Oh, this everything is will be charged to your room here. Don't you worry about a thing. Everything <laughs> in the town will be charged to my room? Uh, yes, sir. Ah, uh, ha, ha, ha. I see. She looks confused. This so, is great. This sounds you, great. What can you tell me about your town? What's uh, what's new? What's going on? What's the oh. new hubbub? Well, you know, the Jenkinses just got a car, and, uh, you know, he's worried his wife's going to want to run it around town and stuff, and the mm. husband's like, oh, 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 you know, women drivers. <laughs> oh, my. And the wife's like, I just don't know if it's appropriate, you know. Mm. For sure, women definitely shouldn't be on the road. The man nods uh, sagely at you. Mm -hmm. The wife looks as though she she's just kind of going with the flow at this point. I see. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, I I finish up uh, eating my breakfast and damn um, good. You feel like a new person. Uh, mm -hmm. You want to drink your coffee? Oh yes, for sure. Uh, black, it nothing, nothing in it. Does it taste? Uh, it tastes like, or... tastes like good strong. Give me a taste roll. Mm hmm. Uh, a fail. <laughs> you burned the shit out of your tongue on it, so wow. you're assuming it's fine. <laughs> well, you you That's... you see the guy with the club uh, making like a, he's starting his bindle early apparently with bacon. It'll be a bacon bindle later. He'll fucking weave the bacon together to make a fucking bindle to carry around his possessions on the end of his club with. It'll be fucking lovely. Because he's fucking nuts. You, you're starting to think that's maybe the case. <laughs> well, he definitely definitely is unsettled, that is for sure. Oh, um, there is little doubt in your fucking mind at this point. <laughs> he's going to be a fun one. <laughs> uh, well, uh, I guess... It, somebody to death soon. I guess it's uh, time to make, make my way to town. Um, they both smile and nod. Uh, empathy rolls. Uh, pass barely. Okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. Uh, where the fuck? All right. Mm-hmm. Oh, damn it. Stop clicking and just tell me if you pass or fail, you freak. Okay, every time I try to touch one fucking window, every other window is like, yeah, we're done. Even though Your I have figure... shrunk and split up. Oh, that could be. You know your, that they uh, go behind each other when you when you use them. They don't go away forever. You just can't see them, Tim. Yeah, I know that. I just, uh, yeah. Hey, this fucker. All right. So what the fuck did I get? A fourteen? Oh, so close. <laughs> no empathy, huh? Huh? <laughs> Got it. Uh, Mike, you think that they're relieved uh, that uh, you are taking uh, your very odd religious friend with you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, I'm not, I'm no, not as relieved that uh, he seems to be uh, very rattled by uh, not knowing where he didn't, you know, not knowing where he woke up. I mean, that happens all the time to me. Yeah. Uh, apparently. Very, uh, you know. Mm -hmm. So, so you go, go outside. Is it sunny? Is the sky, is. is the sun there? It is, and it's beautiful, and I have changed the background map in the Roll20. Now, mm -hmm. if you look at the Roll20 on the uh, the bar on the left, it has like a hand or an arrow at the top. If you click the, the top one, it either gives you select move or pan view. And if you uh, click the pan view, the picture of the hand, then you can left click on the uh, uh, map and drag it around. 
Ooh, fancy. Yes. Oh, anybody can drag it around. So if somebody drags it, somebody else will see it being dragged. Will they? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe. If so you're dragging not... it now, then no. Ah, a bed and breakfast. I look up yep. and see the sign Eugene and what is that door? Well, here's the weird thing that the, there is a sign, but when you look at it, it doesn't register, but you know it's a bed and breakfast. But the words yeah. don't mean anything to you. It just doesn't look like anything to you. And you can also see other buildings uh, in the distance. As you move around, you'll be able to see more shit. Uh, off to the east, indeed, uh, I, unlike uh, some map makers, north is to the top of the fucking map because the people who it isn't are dicks. Uh, he, east is toward the trees. The sun is coming up over there. It looks like it's early in the morning. You're not sure what time. And um, so you're next door to a fire station. Across the street is library, reliable TV, etc. Pretty much, um, yeah. It looks like a normal town. Can you guys give me history rolls to know something else about it? The style of architecture, buildings. If you have architecture, of course, you may also try that. Modern architecture. I really like how this, uh, uh, the feng shui of this town. Mm -hmm. I, mm -hmm. I failed. Got it. Let's go with. Oh, this looks great. Mm -hmm. Oh, man. I it... remember the first time, the first buggy I owned. Yeah, the cars are uh, rather old fucking fashioned here. If you have, uh, if you failed your history, you're not sure, but they're definitely like grandpa type cars. Or something. No clue. Mm -hmm. We're fucking Mars mm -hmm. history. Yeah. <laughs> God damn it. We're in fucking China in the future. <laughs> <laughs> No problem. Uh, for I some reason, it. yeah, there there are people just walking around doing normal people things. You can see uh, some guy in white. He, he, you know, although uh, Tim is convinced he's Chinese, you can't see his face because his back's to you. Uh, he's he's got a bunch of um, uh, white things in a, a kind of mesh of some sort, and he appears to be delivering them to different places as he walks down the street. Uh, and he gets in a, a car that says Moo Cow on the side and, you know, drives off. But, I mean, um... I suppose, while fighting that fire, China could have launched nukes, uh -huh. taken us out. Right. I was found still alive in the aftermath and have been brought here in a test area. Hmm. Yes, that's all perfectly reasonable. <laughs> I give him the slantiest, slanty eye look. Okay. Hmm? Shake my head. All right. Um, God, fucking. It's got to be aliens. It's, it's, uh, it's I mean, aliens I make my way down the road. I'm saying uh, that out loud. I'm like, Wilbur, why the fuck are you so calm? I'm used to things going very poorly very quickly. This is not poorly very quickly. This is a magical level of fucking poorly. Did you I want to go in a swirling hellstorm of fire and burned almost to a cinder at one point? That was yeah, that was really fucking bad. This is not even that level. I uh walk down the street and I see the Bur Burlington fire station. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Did you want to go west or east, Mike? Oh, uh, west, All right. west towards town. No problem. Um, the fire station. Does the fire station have like a little plaque on it that's like uh, fire station, blah, 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 first and stated some year of some variety? It's, Most fire stations have that. It's got a plaque on it, but when you look at it, it doesn't look like anything to you. So the, the words on all of the buildings and stuff, I get kind it of an idea like of what, what they are, but the words don't make any sense. Uh, yeah, it just doesn't look like anything to you. Mm. Uh, 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 there's a, uh, they don't have a station number? There's no station number? Numbers, numbers. No, you're not really familiar with these things yet. Huh? Yeah. Uh. yeah. 
Well, there's a there there appears to be uh, somewhere that has a bunch of books in it. Um, I'm gonna go across the street from the fire station to the book building. No problem. Uh, you guys go into there and hold on. I'm switching maps real quick. I'm gonna sure. I'm gonna catch up to him in just a second. I I want to snoop around the fire station. No problem. Uh, a, a bunch of strapping young men are hanging out doing what firefighters around the world do, uh, waiting for something to burn and maintaining equipment type stuff. Mm -hmm. Meanwhile, uh, you go into the library over there. Here, I'm, You should be now able to see what the interior looks like as well as the librarian. If you pan around your map, you'll find them. Ah, excellent. Uh, I, I see her like filing away at the card catalogs like when I was in school. Uh, uh -huh. the, I just go over to a random book and pull it off the shelf and open it up. Doesn't look like anything at all to you. Mm. I, the the pages have stuff written on them, but it doesn't make any sense. And this uh, is the same for all sure. the books. You're not even sure if there's stuff written on the pages or not. You're just kind of confused and my eyes drift away from the page, even though I try and read it type deal. Nice. Yeah, it just doesn't look like anything to you. Weird. All right. Well, maybe it's a the... trick book. Yeah, I look at the next book. Damn, they got a lot of trick books here. Uh, interesting. Uh, I, I go to the librarian and I go, uh, I apologize. Do you have any uh, books of books on art, uh, like art books? Certainly. She gets you a book. It doesn't look like anything to you. Just uh, pictures kind of like blurry every page. It's not even that. It's just you look at it and nothing is going into your fucking brain at all. You're mm -hmm. like, uh. All right. It's worse than functional illiteracy is now what you're thinking. It's confusing, Excellent. but not too upsetting. You're not sure why you're not upset about this. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, I, I guess uh, I guess this building is useless. Um, so I think the librarian. I make sure all the books are put back where she tells me to. I wouldn't want to mess. Oh, she's got to reshelf. She's got to reshelf them. Oh, great! You are not permitted to do that now. Uh, you go back. Uh, hmm? She smiles. And nods. No problem. You go outside. Wait, the first thing you see questions. outside is. Fucking TJ, like, looking in windows and shit. Oh, yeah. Well, I'll, talk ask, to people. I'll ask him some questions and shit. Oh, yeah. Sure. Okay, great. Um, Hello. Welcome to hey. Burlington Fire Station. How's it going? Uh, handle many big fires? Man. No, we haven't. We haven't uh, today. Uh, nothing nothing yet. But, you know, we're, we're hoping that everything's what's the, okay. What's, what's the, uh, when's the last time you had a fire here? It's been a while. Been a while. People are very aware of fire safety. We do have fire safety classes we hold, hold over at the school. This is no doubt helping. Uh, do they have a fire engine in there? Yes, they do. What's Big red one. Like? Red, really old fashioned. Super <laughs> old fashioned. <laughs> okay. Super, super old fashioned. I was curious fashion. about that. <laughs> I super. was like looking at some of the equipment on. I'm like, hmm. Uh, okay. Uh, do you guys use radios? Ah, uh, radios. Uh, no, uh, we're we're hoping to get some in a couple of years, but uh, you know. And some other guy is talking to another guy in the background, and he's like, "Oh, thank God, it's Friday. I'm going to be having some good times this weekend." Blah blah blah. Normal conversation stuff is going on in the background. It's not like they're just paying attention to you. I'm gonna ask him some. Some fairly basic questions about firefighting and see if he can answer them right. Certainly. Uh, give me a firefighting role. To, you know, I'm just kind of curious as to what kind of questions you ask. Uh, da, da, da. If they sound completely insane or what. Uh, uh -huh. Let's see. Yeah. I got a yeah. I got a yeah. I, uh, nope, wrong, wrong one. I will figure this out. By God, I swear. 
I mean, I've only got two things open. I've got the, the Heroic Cthulhu and the Google Hangout window thing. That's it. I don't know what kind I would, of wild I would say my setup is helpful, but uh, I have four monitors, so everything is on a different monitor. Hmm. I know what I'll be telling oh, you next week. That is 60 inches of Logan, <laughs> Logan <laughs> finger right there. Nice. Dear uh, God. So you, you made it there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, he, he, you, ask him, you ask him reasonable questions. He gives reasonable answers. It does give you another uh, history role thing, though. And our chance at history. History. Huh. History. No escaping. That's for thee. Yeah. Wow. Ooh. Ooh. Nope. Ooh. No. Right. Well, not knowing shit about history. Okay. Uh, he knows a lot about really old-fashioned firefighting techniques. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. All right. Well, at least he's a firefighter. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, clothing. That's why they have the what truck. What clothing are these guys wearing? I'm wearing a fucking white jumpsuit. What the fuck are they wearing? I uh, Actually, no, you're not wearing a white jumpsuit. You're wearing a kind of a, a businessman's grandfather-looking suitish type of okay. thing. All right. But they're right. wearing, like, really, really super old-fashioned firefighting type stuff. Other people on the streets are dressed similarly to what you have, you know, except for the women who are not. Hmm. Yeah. I see. Uh -huh. I see. Yeah. So uh, who do you think is going to win the World Series this year? Oh, I don't know. He looks confused. Uh, big sports fan? No, not really, sir. Now, you see uh, your buddy, who, whose name you may or may not remember, approaching you. He looks concerned. Uh, well, I got to get back to work. It's, it's been good talking to you, he says, as you turn heel and sure. suddenly wander off. Great. He goes back to work, goes a bit relieved to be rid of the strange question, ma'am. And, uh, right, air dude walks up to you. Um, time travel? I'm sorry. What? Time travel? Uh, I I I I I don't understand. Well, everything that's in this town that I can see so far is super fucking old. Yeah, but look at this fire truck. It's super well maintained. That fire truck is illegal to use. For I the mean, I wouldn't call that fucking stopping a fire. I mean, look, it's got water canisters on it. I'm sure they. They pump those every day to make sure that they're pressurized. Hey, Mike, look at this! Look at this pail. Yeah. Uh, is it is it possible to close your shades in the background because it keeps doing these bright, dark, bright, dark, bright, dark, trying to figure out your camera compensation because your <laughs> background is <laughs> super just duper bright. Right at his junk. He's like, there you go, no more light. <laughs> So I'm guessing that's a no, they don't close. Got it. Nope, they don't close. No worries. Okay, oh, you can leave it where it is then. It is what it is. Eventually, you can buy a nice big black blanket or bury out a pirate flag like DJ has. Well, it it is 7, or uh, it it is early in the morning, so the, the sun is shining on that side of the house today. So could you, move the, could you move the sun? I could try. It's going to take a while. All right. Um, Lowers, Fair enough. I'll, I'll let you guys get back talking. I'll be right back. Please continue on. All right. So you remember uh, you nothing. To, uh, Maddox, have you tried to read anything? Yeah. Like book? I, I'm having an issue apparently with my eyes because uh, traditionally yeah. those plaques right there have all kinds of information about this uh, station. Uh huh. Uh huh. Nothing. I'm getting nothing. Mm -hmm. You don't remember what you did for a living? Um, I didn't. I wasn't employed. Um, I did uh, odd jobs for people from time to time. Like a carpenter, odd jobs. Something like that. Fair enough. Got it. People had work that needed do doing, and I went and did it. Okay, odd job guy. Got it. 
Um, do you recall, I don't know, fucking a bright light in the sky before getting here? I remember uh, falling and burning and then uh, waking up in the comfiest bed I've slept in. Ooh. Being served the best breakfast I've had in years. Uh-huh. Yeah, Logan, let me know when a few hours passes, like, three to four. Okay. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh, um, can I get a, the, the map of the town since I'm out of the library? Fucking bizarre. Mm-hmm. Hey, uh, yeah. hmm. um, if you want more detailed descriptions on all this shit, let me know. Basically, yep. or if you just want to walk around, I'll just reveal everything. Doesn't matter. Okay. Uh, well, my uh, my hope is that somewhere. Some at some point in time there'll be something. All right. Um. So next to the library is a TV store. Mm-hmm. There's got a bunch of old, old school big two TVs that are as big as me, but screens are super small. <laughs> You've been on that. The screens are about 15 inches across. But the TV sets are like massive. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. Yeah. What's uh across, what's across the street from the uh the reliable TV store? The, a, a nondescript building of some sort? Uh, it appears to be unused and closed. Like, um, it's just not being used right now. There's nothing special in there or that you can see from here. Just an so, unused building. Okay. So, like, going going over whatnot, there, like, looking through the windows, it just looks unused and empty. Yeah. Yeah, it's got furniture in it, you know, like uh, it could be made into a shop or something or what have you, but nothing's being done with it currently. Got it. Uh, progressing down Main Street, there's uh, uh, a giant school. I assume there's like school mm-hmm. kids running around playing on like a swing set or something like that, or is it a, an old no, school? They're, in, they're inside right now being caught, but yeah, that kind of school. Okay. Um, and then A and W root beer. I would assume that this is like an an old school soda fountain place. Exactly, mm-hmm. and it has the the things you can drive up on the outside and possibly get served by some lady on roller skates. Ooh. Um, and then uh, looks like a clothing store of some variety. Is it like Correct. suits and stuff? Suits and dresses, uh, yeah. or just suits? Suits, dresses. All right, and then uh, a hardware store. It's called the Hardware Corner, yep. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'd like to go into the Hardware Corner. Not a problem at all. And... Let's see. Uh, yep. In there. Oh, man, it's a Sears catalog, but... It blazing it into a building. <laughs> it's, like a, it's like an Amazon store. But with walls. <laughs> um, is there a shopkeeper? Yep. Yeah, hold on. Flipping to there. This hardware corner. Old guy in his fifties, brown slacks, white shirt with rolled up sleeves, leather multi pocketed pocketed vest. He has one of those poker player hats with the green thing on it. Okay. Oh, green eye shades for those who know hats. Mm-hmm. And he comes up and he goes, "Hello, happy Friday." Uh, how's it? Uh, how's it going on this wonderful Friday? Hey, it's a glorious day out, sir. Glorious day, beautiful. So, um, there there were a couple things that I I were was looking to pick up. Uh, I'm staying at the He's looking uh, at the your, bed and you, breakfast down the street. He's looking at your buddy's club, and he goes. That's pretty serious uh, stick you got there. Yeah. Uh, I look over and quickly I go, yeah, uh, he removed the leg from a chair and we're in need of putting it back to together. Um, mm-hmm. He takes you over to glue, nails, screws. Also, he says, we do sell axe handles if you're just wanting a good sturdy stick. 
Got it. He shows you some fine axe handles that make nice clubbing people to death sticks. Um, I also I was, sell the axe head as well, right? Oh, of course. You I have was, the ones uh, with the flat back end? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They got all uh, kinds of shit in here. You let I was, me know. Uh, I'll wondering there. if the um, if you know um, uh, the bed and breakfast down the street. They said that if we needed anything in town, it would just be built in my room. That's correct. And you know who I am. You're staying at the bed and breakfast. Okay. You know everybody that stays at the bed and breakfast. No, but, you know, people come through here, good people, so, yeah, not to worry, whatever you need, what do you need, sir? Okay, um, is it possible for me to make a, uh, lock lore check or something to, uh, or a jerry rig check to, um, get what I need to, like, say, uh, pick a handcuff lock from this time or something along those lines? God, you or don't a, even know what kind of shit they use in these times for uh, handcuffs because your history rolls have been sucking ass. Well, I specifically so, have lock lore. While oh, he's, give me a lock lore roll then, sure. While he's walking around looking for stuff, I'll uh, ask the guy, uh, so what teams are you into? We did pass lock lore. Wow. Uh, yeah, yeah, you... you um, Give me a jury rig roll, and then you'll be buying, because obviously they don't sell lockpicks, but you'll get shit that <laughs> you're not sure if you can pick your own handcuffs with it, but you definitely pick somebody else's. Okay. Um, is the hero thing like a reroll? Uh, Correct. Thing the jig. All right. I'm going to I'm going to use my hero points, and uh, I'm going to turn that 95 to a 47, and pass. Carry on. Uh, yeah, you 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 you're buying shit, and the guy's wrapping it in paper and tying it with string for you because apparently that's the way to do it. Uh, um, and while while in there, I'm also going to get a uh, like a sturdy pocket knife of some variety. Ah, uh, yes, uh, they, they have those. 